In this video, we'll review the 12 best stocks to buy and hold forever. So, before we start, please like this video and subscribe to our channel for weekly updates. Let's get started. Since the beginning of 2022, the S&P 500, NASDAQ, and Dow have all dropped a lot, giving long-term investors some good investment opportunities. Jeremy Siegel, a well-known finance professor at Wharton Business School, thinks that some of the best stocks to buy for the long term are trading on the market right now at very low prices. He thinks that the out-of-control inflation, which is close to its highest level in four decades, will be brought under control as the housing market cools down. Since the start of the pandemic, the US government has increased the amount of money in circulation by 40%. In the past, when the amount of money in circulation has grown, earnings have gone up. Mr. Siegel noticed that at one point, Many well-known stocks went up by 50 to 55 percent from where they were before the pandemic. But lately, the stock market has been weak, so these gains have been cut back to about 20 percent, which makes companies worth less. Most people think that the success of the best long-term stocks like Microsoft Corporation, Amazon.com, and Alphabet Incorporated, is what makes most of the money on the stock market. A study done at the Business School of Arizona State University found that between 1990 and 2020, over 55% of the stocks listed in the US and 57% of the stocks listed in other leading stock markets around the world did not perform as well as risk-free US Treasury bonds. At the same time, only 2.4% of the stocks on these exchanges were responsible for over $75 trillion of the wealth that was made on the stock markets around the world. This means that you need to do careful research to find the best long-term stocks and avoid the majority of stocks that don't do well. Here are our top 12 best forever stocks to buy right now. Number 12. Walmart Incorporated, ticker, WMT. Walmart Incorporated has the distinction of being the biggest retailer in the world. The company has over 10,500 retail locations and a headcount of over 2.2 million employees as of 2022. In a research note issued in October of 2022, Hans Engel at Erste Group upgraded Walmart Incorporated stock from a hold to a buy rating. The analyst believes that Walmart Incorporated offers low but stable growth in sales and is one of the best long-term stocks in the consumer sector. Furthermore, Engel anticipates expansion in Walmart Incorporated's operating margin next year, along with a moderate growth trend in the coming years. Walmart Incorporated's top line is expected to surpass $600 billion by 2025 as the company is investing heavily to combat the rise of Amazon. In October 2022, Walmart Incorporated revealed that it had finalized a deal to buy Alert Innovation, a provider of automated e-grocery fulfillment software. The acquisition is expected to increase the long-term operational efficiency of Walmart Incorporated. The company's annual forward dividend yield stands at 1.74% as of October 10. At the end of Q2 2022, Walmart Incorporated was held by 67 hedge funds. Number 11. The Procter & Gamble Company, ticker, PG. The Procter & Gamble Company is a Cincinnati, Ohio-based consumer goods company. Analysts think the Procter & Gamble Company is one of the best long-term stocks to invest in as it is a defensive company that is expected to hold ground during uncertain macroeconomic times. The stock has a beta of only 0.39, implying low volatility and performance. In an August 2022 research note to investors, Lauren Lieberman at Barclays raised the price target for the Procter & Gamble company from $154 to $157 and kept the stock's overweight rating. The analyst anticipates the Procter & Gamble company stock to outperform the broader market if the company markets its defensive nature efficiently. The Procter & Gamble company offers an annual forward dividend yield of 2.94% as of October 2022 translating into an annual payout of $3.65. The company generated solid shareholder returns in 2022 with share buyback programs of $10 billion and total dividends higher than $9 billion. Analysts think the Procter & Gamble company is currently trading at a discount of nearly 42% to its fair value. Number 10. Tesla Incorporated, ticker, TSLA. Tesla Incorporated is one of the most prominent names in the electric vehicle or EV segments as a vertically integrated EV corporation under the leadership of Elon Musk. In October of 2022, Vijay Rakesh at Mizuho gave positive comments on Tesla Incorporated stock. The analyst believes that the company's Q3 2022 results were in line with expectations. 
Although the EV industry is continuing to face challenges related to supply chain and logistics, the demand side is showing very few signs of weakness as a shift towards electrification is under process in China and other leading countries of the world. In September of 2022, analysts gave Tesla Incorporated stock a buy rating with a target price of $370. In October of 2022, the China Passenger Car Association, CPCA, revealed that Tesla Incorporated sold a record 83,135 EVs in China in September. This reflected an increase of 8% from the sales made in August. Analysts think that Tesla offers an optimistic growth story and is likely to observe an increase in per-unit margins due to its advanced manufacturing abilities. The company's solid operations merit its inclusion among the best long-term stocks to buy. Number 10. Exxon Mobil Corporation, ticker, XOM. Exxon Mobil Corporation is a Texas-based diversified energy giant that is considered by analysts as one of the best long-term stocks to hold. In a research note issued in September 2022, Neil Mehta at Goldman Sachs reiterated a buy rating on Exxon Mobil Corporation stock with a target price of $112 following a meeting with CEO Darren Woods and other members of the senior management team. The analyst believes that Exxon Mobil Corporation has an important role to play in the transition towards renewable energy as the company is focusing on projects that are related to biofuels, hydrogen, and carbon capture and storage. Meta also added that Exxon Mobil Corporation could repurpose its crude oil refining facilities into biofuel, chemical, lubricant, and plastic recycling facilities. Exxon Mobil Corporation has generated returns of over 60% in the last year. The company is undertaking initiatives to optimize its costs and is expected to surpass the profit margin expectations for this year. Exxon Mobil Corporation has a forward dividend yield of 3.48% as of October 2022. Number 9. Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing Company Limited, ticker, TSM. Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing Company Limited is based in a leading semiconductor manufacturing company that has a wide range of applications in the electronics industry. Rick Xu at Daiwa upgraded Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing Company Limited from a buy to an outperform rating in September 2022. Despite an expectation of an industry-wide correction, the analyst believes that Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing Company Limited, NYSE, TSM, will experience top-line growth as it continues to gain market share and more pricing power. Experts see the revenue of Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing Company Limited to be countercyclical due to the company's advanced technical capabilities leading to its dominance. Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing Company Limited is also in discussion with Apple regarding the production of two nanometers chips, as the maker of the iPhone is interested in integrating the smaller chips into its products in the future. Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing Company Limited's bright growth prospects make it one of the best long-term stocks to invest in. Number 8. Johnson & Johnson, ticker, JNJ. Johnson & Johnson is a New Jersey-based healthcare company with a rich history of over 135 years. The company has a headcount of over 140,000 employees. Joanne Wunsch at City gave Johnson & Johnson stock a target price of $198 and maintained a buy rating in a research note issued in October of 2022. Ahead of Johnson & Johnson's Q3 results, the analyst shared a bullish take on the company's device utilization levels, along with improved pricing for the medical supplies and technology segment. Wunsch thinks that the best outcome for Johnson & Johnson would be to post in-line delivery numbers and reiterate its 2022 forecasts. Johnson & Johnson is spinning off its consumer healthcare segment to focus more on the pharmaceutical and medical technology business. Johnson & Johnson is one of the dividend kings on this list, which means that the company has raised its dividends for the last 50-plus consecutive years. The company marked its 60th consecutive year of dividend growth in April of 2022 with a 6.6% increase in the quarterly dividend. Furthermore, Johnson & Johnson has seen its free cash flow grow steadily to almost $20 billion over the last 10 years. These fundamentals reflect the company's consistent growth, making it one of the best long-term stocks to buy now. Number 7. J.P. Morgan Chase & Company, ticker, JPM. J.P. Morgan Chase & Company is one of the most prominent firms in the global financial services industry. The biggest bank in the U.S. in terms of assets has incorporated 1,200 financial institutions in its portfolio. Keith Horowitz at Citi added J.P. Morgan Chase & Company to a positive stock watch list in October of 2022. The analyst has assigned J.P. Morgan Chase & Company stock a target price of $135 and a buy rating. 
The analysts are forecasting that JP Morgan Chase and company will surpass the consensus revenue estimates for the period and revise its 2022 guidance. Analysts think the current economic situation provides an opportunity for investors to look for solid contrarian investments. JP Morgan Chase and company fits this criterion as it is amongst some of the leading banks with high dividend yields trading at very low valuations. JP Morgan Chase and company has always had high returns on equity, and it is in a good position to keep doing so. Aerial Investments shared its stance on JP Morgan Chase and company in its Q4 report. Number 5. Berkshire Hathaway Incorporated, ticker, BRKB. Berkshire Hathaway Incorporated is an Omaha, Nebraska-based conglomerate with a diversified range of businesses ranging from insurance, banking, and railroad services. Furthermore, the company has taken a significant stake in the leading corporations of the world through its investment arm. The company is led by Warren Buffett, who is considered a wizard in finding the best long-term stocks by employing the philosophy of value investing. On September 21, James Shanahan at Edward Jones upgraded Berkshire Hathaway Incorporated stock from a hold to a buy rating. Between 2016 to 2021, Berkshire Hathaway Incorporated has observed its operating cash flow rise at a compound annual growth rate of 3.8% from $32.64 billion to $39.41 billion. The stock currently trades at 1.5x book value and 2.6x sales. Keeping these factors in consideration, analysts think Berkshire Hathaway Incorporated should be trading at more than double its current share price. Over the next five years, Berkshire is expected to expand its annual revenues by 10% each year due to growth in its energy and manufacturing businesses. Number 4. Apple Incorporated, ticker, AAPL. Apple Incorporated is a California-based tech giant that has emerged as the biggest publicly listed company in the US. Apple Incorporated's current stock price of $140 represents that the stock is trading close to 20x its forward PE ratio. Given the company has a 100% return on capital employed, this is an attractive valuation. The company is also transitioning from being a provider of hardware to a provider of subscription services through its various platforms. Since the start of 2022, Apple Incorporated has added over 30 million paid subscribers to its various platforms. The revenue growth of the subscription business is faster than the overall revenue growth of Apple Incorporated because of its track record of steady growth and solid operations. Analysts rank Apple as one of the best long-term stocks. Number 3. Alphabet Incorporated, ticker, GOOGL. Alphabet Incorporated is a Mountain View, California-based holding company that owns Google, YouTube, and several other subsidiaries. In a research note issued in October of 2022, Justin Post at Bank of America gave Alphabet Incorporated a target price of $114 and reiterated a buy rating. In the current uncertain macroeconomic environment, the analyst anticipates the company's EPS to remain resilient as Alphabet Incorporated is working on controlling its costs. This is similar to what the company did in 2009 following the financial crisis of 2008. Mr. Post highlighted Alphabet Incorporated stock as a top value stock in the tech sector. Around 90% of Alphabet Incorporated's revenue is generated from Google, which has a market share of 84% in the online search segment. Google is likely to sustain its leadership position in the industry in the long run. Alphabet Incorporated is currently trading at its 10-year low PE, allowing investors an attractive opportunity to invest in one of the best long-term stocks in the market. Number 2. Amazon.com Incorporated, ticker, AMZN. Amazon.com Incorporated is a Seattle, Washington-based e-commerce giant that has ventured into cloud services, digital streaming, consumer electronics, and various other segments. The company has become a mainstay in the lives of the U.S. consumer. Amazon.com Incorporated is gearing up for the holiday season as it intends to hire 150,000 employees across the U.S. Despite concerns related to retail spending and the growth of cloud services, JP Morgan highlighted Amazon.com Incorporated as its top pick by a wide margin. The financial services firm thinks that Amazon.com Incorporated will continue to experience year-over-year -year revenue growth, margin expansion, and moderation in capital expenditure in the coming years. These factors will provide a tailwind to the bottom line of the company. JP Morgan also anticipates Amazon Prime services to perform well in the upcoming quarters due to faster delivery times and better stocking levels. Number 1. Microsoft Corporation, ticker, MSFT. Microsoft Corporation is a Washington-based tech giant that was co-founded by Bill Gates. The company has dominated the hardware and software segment through its various offerings. 
Microsoft Corporation has continuously reinvented itself throughout the decades, and it seems that the company intends to leverage enterprise customers by offering cloud-based offerings like Azure and Office 365 to gain an advantage in this decade. Microsoft Corporation has tried to gain leadership in the gaming industry by acquiring Activision Blizzard for a sum of $68.7 billion. The company is already home to Xbox 360, which is one of the leading gaming consoles in the world. In a note issued in September of 2022, analysts at Morgan Stanley shared that Microsoft Corporation stock offers an attractive risk and reward profile. On October 8, Microsoft Corporation also announced a 10% increase in the quarterly dividend to $0.68 cents per share. The company's dividend increase, coupled with the EPS growth in the high teens highlights Microsoft Corporation's solid return profile. These factors have led us to term Microsoft Corporation as one of the best long-term stocks in the market. Even though the stocks on our list may not have had the best stock price growth in recent years, they have been able to make their shareholders a lot of money by giving out good dividends and buying back shares. Which of these stocks would you like to own forever? Let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for the best stocks to buy and the latest investment strategies for building wealth. Thank you for watching.